Good morning. There's Jimmy. <laughs> it's travel day. We are leaving Elephant Butte Lake State Park in New Mexico and headed to Manzano Mountains. So we're going from the desert to the forest to the mountains. Looking forward to that climbing. It's getting hotter in the months and we're heading north slowly as it's starting to get warmer. So, but today is another chili cheeseburger day. Yeah, I'll tell you more about that in um, a little later when we get there. But it is the Owl Bar and Cafe or something. And they open at 9 o'clock this morning. It's 8.15, so we'll get there a little bit after they open. Or later, we might do a little sightseeing, we'll see. But, um, it's another chili cheese. Green chili cheese burger taste. Apparently, and I'll read it in that magazine, or, uh, yeah, I don't have the magazine in here. But they state the claim on being the first invented the chili cheeseburger. They're the first ones to put the chili on the cheeseburger. So, anyway, I'm sure that is... Head north, then slight right. Up for d debate, but anyway, that's what the um, magazine said. So we might see more about that history of... Th about that when we get there. But looking forward to um, this one. So, y'all come along. We're at the Owl Bar and Cafe in San Antonio, New Mexico. Hi, everybody. Where are we? We are at the world famous Owl Bar and Cafe. 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 Deborah went and asked for a straw. They don't have straws here either. All the places where you get chili cheeseburgers, they don't have straws. Just What's up with not having straws? Chili cheese fries. Mm. There it is. Okay, this one comes with lettuce, tomatoes, onions, pickles, cheese, and green chili. That's what I'm talking about. No mayonnaise. <laughs> These places have no mayonnaise and no straws. Oh, look, we did get straws. Those were where the cheese fries are gone almost. Okay, I was wrong. There's mayonnaise on the bottom bun. So you can put a dollar on the wall. I like this better because you write whatever you want to on the paper and not the dollar like someplace else I've been. And I'm not sure if it's once a year. I'll have to look in that magazine. But they donate all these dollars. There we go. What'd you write? You too. Cool RV gas. You want to put the dollar with it? <laughs> no, I'm going to keep the dollar. <laughs> That's the whole point of this, isn't it? <laughs> and there's a trick. It's a two dollar bill. Oh, somebody did a two dollar bill. That's just... I got a two dollar bill the other day. You did? I did. I got a pointer for you. You put it in the sink. <laughs> well, it's easy. Easy. Done. Look at that. 
Oh man, the old one. Yeah. Well, they got a sticker. Is that what you were saying? Oh yeah, Al Bar and Cafe, and it's gone all over the world. All these different people. Isn't that cool? Okay, we just left the owl. <laughs> Here comes a loud truck. Oh, of course. <laughs> happens every time. Every time when we're at a green chili cheeseburger place. Alright, so what do you think of this chili cheeseburger? Green chili cheeseburger. Green chili cheeseburger. Uh, well, um, and you've already told them it was it's supposed to, they created it here. Yeah. So, um, I liked, and I hate to say this, because I didn't like the loudness of Sparky's and Hatch, but their green chili cheeseburger tasted better to me at Sparky's than here. Uh, what I liked here is they served it with lettuce, tomatoes, a cheeseburger. So it's lettuce, tomato, onions, and pickles, and mayonnaise. There was mayonnaise on it, and green chilies. Yeah. So I like that, but the meat, it was tender, and but it didn't have as much taste as Sparky's. But both so. places are so yes. unique. Yes. I, they're worth they're worth visiting, if nothing else, for the uniqueness <laughs> of it. They're crazy good. You get service at your table here at Sparky's. It's a, a drop pick your up. order off yeah. and go pick it up when they call your name. Pick it up at the window. Yeah. But both were great they, atmosphere, except for the loudness at Sparky's for me. Yeah, true. They had great music here. Oldies, yeah. Carpenters. I wanted to dance, and Jana wouldn't get up and dance with me. <laughs> What was it? Carpenters, Anne Murray, Air Supply. It was great. <laughs> Bee Gees. Yeah. All right. We got to get on the road. Let's go.